Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am coming to you with all my little baby hairs and very red tired eyes <laughs> for a vlog. I am cooking for the whole family, all on me, the whole shebang, the whole Easter dinner. Um, I think there's about 15 of us and I wanted to just vlog my experience because it might be a hot damn mess. <laughs> all right, so let's get started. So like I said, I'm kind of, I'm doing it all myself, so I'm starting the day before so I can get some things pre-chopped and pre-made that can just go in the oven tomorrow and then making the rest tomorrow. Like all the main things like the meatloaf and the mac and cheese, I'll do that tomorrow because they taste the best when they're fresh. So I'm using a, a couple of different recipe books. I um, starting out with Joanna's. I am going to be making for appetizer her spinach and artichoke dip and as a side her mac and cheese and then from Chrissy Teigen she has all of the best yummy food that's kind of fattening but oh my gosh so good um, I'm making her roasted mushrooms as a side a green bean casserole and for the main attraction her spicy Italian sausage meatloaf. So right here on my fridge, I have put everything that I'm cooking, everything that I'm cooking here, and the temperature and times for everything, just so I can kind of keep organized and see if I can get it all done well and together, I don't know. <laughs> all right, I've got all the ingredients to start the green bean casserole. I'm gonna do that now. You like cheese, Chloe? Mm-mm. Is it good? Yeah. Good stuff? Mm. Yeah. got the um, green bean casserole in the oven and we're gonna start prepping the mac and cheese now. <laughs> So, the 
casserole is done. The pasta for the mac and cheese is all cooked up. Chloe is down for bed. The husband's out on the balcony reading and I am going to put on uh, Beyonce's homecoming and shred the rest of this cheese for tomorrow and then go to bed because I'm going to be up early tomorrow making the rest of the food. All right, so it's the next morning. I am running about an hour and a half behind how I uh, wanted things to go this morning, but it's fine. Try not to freak out. Uh, my little helper is here to help me and we're gonna get started cooking everything up before two o'clock hopefully <laughs> fingers crossed got all the ingredients for the meatloaf i'm gonna start that now Since I'm making so many things from scratch, I decided to just pick up these um, quick little potato things. You can cook them in the little thing they come in. Super easy, just throw some olive oil on and throw them in the oven. So I'm gonna do that now. kind of footage I have and haven't gotten um, yet. I look absolutely crazy with no brows and mascara. But anyway, um, it is now 1.40. Lunch is supposed to be served at two. The meatloaf, the mushrooms, the potatoes are all in the oven. I'm working on the mac and cheese now. I had to x on the artichoke dip. That wasn't, that was just, it wasn't gonna fit in. <laughs> with the plans. Um, so I just gotta do the mac and cheese, put my eyebrows and mascara on, do something with my hair, get dressed, and then head over. So let's hurry up and do that now and take a moment to but believe me it's delicious so here's the fit for the day the uh, whole outfit the top and the bottoms are both from American Eagle the shoes are from Kate Spade my um, little hair thingy is from
anthropology. Uh, these earrings are also anthropology. This necklace, Kate Spade. This necklace, Kate Spade. Uh, that's my engagement ring. This thumb ring is from like H&M. This ring is H&M. This ring my husband made me. And makeup is very overdone, but I haven't done my makeup in a while, so I was feeling just a little overzealous, especially with these huge lashes. But yeah, that's that's the fit for the day. Cute little spring Easter fit. You can see my bathroom. Oops. I think it's cute. <laughs> As per usual, if I can find everything, it'll be linked down below in the description. And this is the meal all done. We got mac and cheese, potatoes, mushrooms. We made some chicken nuggets for some of the picky eaters, green bean casserole, and meatloaf. Hey, Chloe. Hi, gorgeous. And then after lunch, the kids did their Easter egg hunt. This was Chloe's first year participating, and she was super cute about it. She forgot to sign off that day, but Chloe was wiped out. She took a nap right after hanging out with the kids and doing the Easter egg hunt. And after that, um, we just played board games with the family until bedtime, really. So it's the next day. Chloe had way too much fun yesterday and did not have the patience to open her, open her Easter basket. So we're going to do that now and see if she likes whatever she got. Right. What you got? Sorry. What you got? What you got? You got a puzzle? Oh, let's see. You got some mac and cheese. Some cauliflower mac and cheese. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> got some gripe water for my leg. We got fiber and protein bars. Your favorite protein bars. You got a bunny book. Get the itsy bitsy bunny. Please don't eat that. Ooh, we got some goldfish. Goldfish. No. No. You wanna eat? Oh, look. Ooh. You wanna wear it? Look how pretty you are. Look at you, cutie. Yeah, you got cute stuff, huh? You got cute stuff. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna show the camera you got cute stuff. This is the carnage of everything that she got after she's dumped it all out of the Easter basket. 
yeah, so uh, good Easter. <laughs> she, of course, doesn't care about any of this except for this random pack of gel markers that is going to be hidden from her as soon as she goes to sleep because she doesn't need that. And of course, her favorite thing also is these necklaces that she got. Did you have a good Easter? Yeah, good Easter? <laughs> you helping?